Good afternoon and thank you for coming to this dedication of Peewee Valley's Mail Crane. First, I would like to recognize current and former employees of the Peewee Valley Post Office that are here with us today. Dee Dee Hendrickson. Where are you, Dee Dee? There's Dee Dee back there. Uh, she's retired, former postmaster. She worked at the Peewee Valley Post Office for 18 and a half years. Randy Cross is back here on this side to the right. She is the former postmaster. Right before I came to the Peewee Valley Post Office, she was there for 10 years. Sharon Elder, standing right beside her, is a retired clerk. She had been post office for 13 years. And we also have, as many of you all know and love very well, Spud Brock, <laughs> current clerk at the post, post, uh, Peewee Valley Post Office for three years. Um, I am grateful to Postmaster Fletcher's grandson, Mike, and the rest of the family for allowing the Peewee Valley, uh, for presenting the mail crane to the city, and to Donna for allowing the Peewee Valley Post Office to be a part of such a special occasion. The Postal Service has a proud history of marking such community events with a pictorial postmark. The pictorial postmark is usually designed by a local artist, and this postmark is no exception. The Mail by Rail pictorial postmark was designed by our very own Shelley Shippert. Shelley, <laughs> Shelley is an award-winning graphic designer and the Senior Manager Asset Management Technology at Brown Foreman Global Design. She is a Peewee, and yes, that's how you say it, and a member of the Peewee Valley Historical Society. Shelley has lent her talents to several historical society projects in the past, including the Little Colonel Tour Book in 2007 and the Kentucky but Confederate Home Confederate Memorial Day observance in 2010. Shelley has done an excellent job in not only capturing the historical significance of the mail by rail here in Pee Wee Valley, but she has also included the famous Pee Wee Valley fence that is well known by Pee Wee Valley residents. She designed the postcard uh, as well that features a picture on the front of what they call the well-worn path to the post office and on the back a little history of the mail by rail uh, on the back of the postcard. These postcards will be available at Town Hall uh, for the price of the 47 cent stamp that we will place on the postcard and then we will hand cancel for you with the mail by rail pictorial postmark. Once again, I really appreciate everybody coming out today. I appreciate the Fletcher family and Donna Russell and the city of Pee Wee Valley. And I look forward to seeing all of you all over at Town Hall. Thank you. Back this summer in August, we were, the city of Pee Wee Valley received the gift of um, our mail, mail crate. The crane hasn't been in use since 1968. It was set aside by one of our former postmasters, Matthew Fletcher. Mackie Fletcher, who was the postmaster in Peewee Valley, um, was involved with using this thing back when the railroad and the mail was being delivered by the trains. Uh, and that's what they used to, uh, to operate uh, mail by, by the train. Uh, when he passed away, uh, he, he bought one of these or got one of these and he stored it in his, in his house. Uh, and then Mike Thompson, his grandson, found it when he was t cutting up a tree. Uh, dug it out and had it in the back of his pickup truck. He brought it by City Hall. Um, so we took it over to the town of Storian and then that's how it all started. Uh, took it to Allgaier's and they sandblasted it. They started researching it. Uh, there were pieces they didn't have. They went back with a metal detector and found those, dug them out. And uh, then we, we, put, we installed it right here. 